Hello there, my name is Valerie White Williams and I'm a voice teacher and a vocal coach for Vocal Splendor Studios. Today I'm doing another reaction video and this time I'm back to reacting to Liliac, the family band, and their new single, Sail Away. Let's have a listen. for them and I really like it and the younger boy and the keyboard he's growing up it's so fun to see them grow up I love family bands and Melody her voice even with her she just has a really unique tone you know her face has this big wide just lots of vocal color and even singing under her breath she's got this she's got something special for sure can we sail, sail away, catch the falling star, and reach beyond the night, well, there's no light. Hmm. Something's out of phrase We're flying with broken wings And now holding on to dreams They would only let us fall apart And all I feel is pain I'm stopping from my mistake Now I'm screaming at the wall For ripping your Obviously, it's recorded in the studio and they're doing the video, but it's really entertaining and the strings totally different for those guys. But Melody still has that growl kind of sound and she makes it sound so easy, really. And I heard they started in the choirs in that area, so that's a big stretch from choral singing to.
was really something. I enjoyed it. Definitely the softer touch, but still with some rock in it. And the video was stunning, absolutely stunning. There's so many things I liked about it. Just playing on outside and then the rock guitarist on the rocks. That was so cool. And all the shots, really great artistic. And then the choir coming in, the orchestra. That was really cool, really cool. And I'm just so impressed with all those kids. And again, I remember seeing the little keyboard player. He was just like a little boy. So they're all growing up. And family bands are so special because they understand each other, they can work together. It's just, there's something about a family band. And I love all the family bands. The other family band I love is the Rail Brothers in the Philippines because you know what? You can just work with your family like nobody. And yeah, you can fight too, but sometimes getting through the fights is gonna make things even better. And that band, those kids are talented and they continuously work on their craft. I can see that, you know, so they're always upping their game. And this, again, is something different. It is an original and Melody is just stunning. She's just a stunning singer and definitely a throwback to, um, yeah, the person she covered. I know names never come to me at the moment. Um, Janis Joplin, that's it. And she has that raspy sound that makes it so easy. And, you know, I've studied with Melissa Cross and she is called the Scream Queen. And I don't know if these kids study from her or how they learn to do that because so many people trash their voice trying to make those sounds. But it's so easy for Melody. She just, and then she's just got that stage presence. She just really uses her whole body. I know as I was a young performer, I felt really self-conscious about that, but she's just totally engaged as a rock singer and even throwing the mics around and gorgeous voice, gorgeous hair. All of them are great and I totally enjoyed it. It was really fun. In fact, it's one of those ones I want to watch again. So you know if I want to watch it again, it's that good because I just want to see it again and see how they did it and just great cinematography, cinematography, that's it. Great, and the kids are growing up and doing well. So they're another band that I was so happy did not sign with Simon Cowell. I'm not a Simon Cowell fan because, you know, he wants to put people in these boxes that he thinks he can make money off of. And this band is way too talented for that. They need to just do their own thing. I think they have great instincts. I think their dad is the one that got them singing and coaching. They're doing a great job, doing a great job with those kids. And it's great to see, you know, Melody as this rock tradition that is kind of lost right now with all the rappers. <laughs> and don't get me wrong, I do love rap, but I don't like the trashy rap, just saying. Okay, so that's how it is. And if you guys love Liliac as much as I do, make sure you subscribe, click on the bell, so you get notified of all my uploads. And I also wanna let you know, if you are interested in voice lessons, I have been teaching online since 2011. And like I said, I've had so many great teachers, including Ms. Melissa Cross, that has taught me how to do some of the um, scratch vocals and the noise in the voice, as we like to call it. So if you're interested, you can get me through my website at vocalsplendor.com. And I've worked with people from all levels, from beginners to professionals, from children to, you know, older adults. So I work with almost everybody. And then I also want to let you know of my two free passion projects. The first one is called Creative Soul Alignment, and that's a group on Facebook. It's a private group where we are interested in spirituality and the arts, because when we're creating, we're experiencing that divine flow because greater creating, come on, it's the same thing. So we have everybody there. I have people from all over the world in my YouTube channel and lots of interesting music. Everything's fair game. We have crafts, we have you know, all sorts of music. We have singer songwriters, we have artists, we have photographers, painters, you name it. It's a great group. And then my other group is called YouTube Success Strategies. And that's my latest venture where I'm teaching people how to succeed on YouTube. Because I've kind of figured out what you need to do to grow and I'm teaching people and doing free challenges in that group. So if you're interested, you can find all the information below in the description. 
All right, take care, you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.